Hey guys, my name is Scobby. Today I'm going to be showing you how to play Nintendo DS games on your Mac. This is going to be a nice quick and easy tutorial. On screen I know you can see me playing some Viva Pinata. Let's jump right into this. So the first thing I want to do is come to this link. Links are always in the description down below. And on this webpage we're going to be downloading the Desmoom Nintendo DS emulator for Mac. This is 100% free. So once you're over here we're going to be clicking the latest release version for Desmoom, which in my case is 0.9.11. And we're going to be heading over to the download page once we get to this next page. Once we're here, we're going to see the list of applications that we can download. In this case, we're going to be downloading the Mac application. What you want to do is click that. You'll be brought over to a SourceForge link. You'll have to wait five seconds, and then your download will begin. Once your download is finished, you want to move the Desmoom application to a location where you can find it easily. I have mine on my desktop, and you want to double-click to open up the application. Once you double-click and open up the Desmoom application, you'll be brought to this little folder. And what you want to do is double-click the Desmoom application on the bottom left. And you may get this little pop-up message saying Desmoom cannot be opened because it's from an unidentified developer. If you get this, it's really easy to fix. What you want to do is come up to the top left and click on the Apple logo. We're going to go to System Preferences. You want to go to Security and Privacy. And then on here at the bottom, you'll see this little pop-up message saying Desmoom was blocked from opening because it's an unidentified developer. But what you want to do is click open anyway and then enter the credentials of an admin on your PC. Or if you already admin, you're just going to have to enter the password of the PC. Once you have all this entered, all you want to do is click modify settings, click open, and then your application will open up. Now that we have the application opened up, we're going to be closing it down so we can talk a little bit about the games. So I'm not going to be showing you in today's video where to download games, but games are really, really easy to find. A quick Google search will help you out. And your games will most likely come in a .zip, .rar, or .7zip file. If it comes in a .7zip file, you will need a separate software called Kika, which is a free extraction software that you can use really easily for Mac. So what you're going to do is come to this website and download Kika if you need it in this case. But you want to get this and then double click to extract your game. And your games will come out in a folder like this. But once you have your file extracted, out, you want to double click to open it and you're looking for games in a .nds format as you can see i viva pinata right here in a .nds but once you have your game found you want to open up desmoom again we're going to go to file load rom you want to locate to where your rom is in this case it's right here for me you want to click ok and then your rom will begin to play and it's as simple as that to play nintendo ds games on your mac the games run really smooth and they're really really easy to set up and get playing and it's as simple as that to play nintendo ds games on your mac if you guys enjoyed this tour be sure to drop a like subscribe if you're new check out the other videos on the channel i'm gonna leave a link to my mac emulator playlist in the top of the description down below if you want to check that out to see some more emulators from mac if you want to request any tutorials let me know in the comments down below i'm also going to leave a link to my paypal in the description down below if you want to support the channel of course there's no pressure if you can't anyway guys thank you so much for watching until next time as always keep it saucy peace